Love Calls Us to the Things of This World by Richard Wilbur. The eyes open to the cry of pulleys and spirited from sleep, the astounded soul hangs for a moment, bodiless and simple as false dawn. Outside the open window, the morning air is all awash with angels. Some are in bedsheets, some are in blouses, some are in smocks. But truly, there they are, now all rising together in calm swells of halcyon feeling, filling whatever they wear with the deep joy of their impersonal breathing. Now they are flying in place, conveying the terrible speed of their omnipresence, staying and moving like white water. Now of a sudden they swoon down into a wrapped a quiet that nobody seems to be there. The soul shrinks from all that it is about to remember, from the punctual rape of every blessed day, and cries. Oh, I hope there is nothing on earth but laundry, nothing but rosy hands, in rising steam and clear dances in the sight of heaven. Yet the sun acknowledges with a warm look the world's hunks and colors. The soul descends once more in bitter love to the accepting body. Saying now in a changed voice, the man yawns and rises Bring them from their ruddy gallows. Let clean linen on the backs of thieves. Let lovers go sweet and fresh to be undone. And the heaviest nuns walk in the pure floating of dark habits, keeping their difficult balance. <laughs> 